Hello everyone, welcome to Static GK quiz number 203. This video is aimed to help you with your state and central government exams like SSC, UPSC, state PSCs and banking and insurance related examinations like RRB, IBPS, etc. I'm Mithrisha from GK today and I'll be taking you through this. The highest peak in the Western Ghats in India, highest point in South India and also the highest point in India outside the Himalaya Karakoram system is Anamudi, Kerala. So Anamudi is a mountain uh, located in the Indian state of Kerala. It is the highest peak in the Western Ghats in South India at an elevation of 2,695 meters and a topographic prominence of 2,479 meters. It lies on the border of Devikulam Taluk Idduki district and Kothamangalam Taluk, Ernakulam district. Shale is an example of what? The correct answer is it's an example of sedimentary rock. It's a fine grained clastic sedimentary rock composed of mud that is a mix of flakes of clay mineral and tiny fragments of other minerals, especially quartz and calcite. Shale is characterized by breaking along thin laminae or parallel layering or bedding less than 1 cm in thickness called facility. Which among the following are constituents of institutional credit delivery system in India? Correct answer is regional rural bank, commercial banks and cooperative credit institutions. The institutional credit has been conceived to play a pivotal role in the agricultural development of India. However, the persistence of money lenders in rural credit market is still a major concern. The shape of Vibrio bacteria is, correct answer, it is comma shaped. Vibrio is a genus of gram-negative bacteria possessing a curved rod shape, several species of which can cause foodborne infections, usually associated with eating undercooked seafood. In which of the following countries the first stock exchange opened? Correct answer is Netherlands. The first stock exchange was in Netherlands when the Dutch East India Company issued the first shares of the Amsterdam Stock Exchange. In which year Government of India approved national policy for farmers? Correct answer is 2007. Government implemented the national policy for farmers in 2007, which aimed to improve economic viability of farming and increase net income of farmers. A system in which a society consisting of a number of farmers owns land which is divided into smaller holdings and then leased to individual members of the society comes under which of the following? Correct answer is cooperative tenant farming. It is a society which purchases or leases in land form the government or some private persons and then in turn leases out the land to its members. The members cultivate the land and pay the rent falling to their share to the society. National Tiger Conservation Authority was constituted in which year? Correct answer is 2005. The National Tiger Conservation Authority was established in December of 2005 following a recommendation of the Tiger Task Force constituted by the Prime Minister of India for reorganized management of Project Tiger and the many tiger reserves in India. START or Strategic Arms Reduction Treaty is a series of treaties negotiated between which of the two nuclear powers of the world? Correct answer is US and Russia. START was a bilateral treaty between the United States of America and the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics on the reduction and limitation of strategic offensive arms. The treaty was signed on 31st July 1991 and entered into force on 5th December 1994. Valmiki National Park or Valmiki Tiger Reserve is located in which of the following states? Correct answer is Bihar. Valmiki National Park, Tiger Reserve and Wildlife Sanctuary is located at the India-Nepal border in the West Champaran district of Bihar, India on the bank of River Gandak. It is the only national park in Bihar. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.